Carl Eckerly in the lead, Steve Zom following, presenting our colors today during the anthem. All the Zaggies are going after the P-51. And there's a collision right there in front of us. One down, somebody marked that where it went in. Here comes the other one. Looks like he's still got the control surface. Was that Mike? Mike landed his. The other one kind of seeked the tall grass. Somebody's got a piece of his tail hanging off the wingtip. I don't know who that is. Bob, is that you with the streamer hanging off your wingtip? Oh, it's Paul. Okay. The guy with the plaid shirt got a cut. That's pretty cool. Takes off complete. Getting ready for a double stall turn. Oh, coming back. Okay, doing a trim right now. Going vertical. Rolling over. A split S. Entering the box. Going vertical. Quarter roll, taking the rudder over, not going any farther than the wingspan of the two point coming down, powering on, going vertical again, quarter roll, taking right rudder, descent coming down, and this is going to be his trombone, the next maneuver, when he comes back in the box. Okay. He rolled. Coming around. Pyramid loop. Descending up right, another two point, and pulling. Avalanche is next. Well, I'm messing you up. Sorry, Tim. Humpty bump. Oh, that was the Humpty bump. I lost my spot. Now he's going to pull into that giant loop with a snap roll at the top. There is his avalanche. Next maneuver will be called a reverse shark's tooth. That thing flies so clean, it's cool. Oh yeah, it's smooth. Of course the guy on the sticks has something to do with it too. Here comes one of my favorite maneuvers, a slow roll. Aileron, right aileron, and top rudder. Excellent job. Stall turn. Two of four going up. There is rudder kicked over. Rolling to invert it. A top hat. Push, going vertical. He'll square off at the top. Full roll, coming down, descending, push the turn out. I'm going to do a half Cuban eight <laughs> from inverted. A bow tie. I'm not familiar with this one either. I have to watch how he does it. Tim just returned from a pattern competition 
down in the Detroit area, and I guess he took second place. So he's got some experience. He knows what he's doing. Down on a 45, an ampersand is next half a roll up. Down on a 45. Pushing over the top. Square loop with quarter rolls. Top half, top hat with quarter rolls. Squaring off the top, descending vertically. Top hat's like an Abe Lincoln hat. And a mandatory four point roll, nicely done. Half square loop with a half roll up. And he's going to do a three turn spin. There's one, two, three. Oh. He got him in. Okay. Exiting the box. Preparing to land. Boy, that plane is just so graceful, Tim. Very, very impressive. There's another lovely slow roll. And from left to right, coming in for landing, Tim Brzezinski. Excellent job. This hand's for you, Tim. Nice demonstration. Nice job, Tim. Gene Thompson. Off the vertical. Hammerhead or stall turn into a spin. Upright spin. Aileron roll. There's the mandatory four point roll. Well, three of it anyhow into a knife edge 360. Over the top, look like a Cuban eight. Another stall turn into an upright spin. Roll to inverted. Pushing over the top. And the Cuban 8. Inverted. Was that a cornhole? I should have filmed jeans. It's a good pattern too. Three, four, five, six, seven, and an eight point roll. That was nice. Okay, 
Zealand pilots are walking out across the flight line. Spectators will remind you again, these guys are going to do their very best to keep the flying wings out in front of them, but sometimes when they collide, they lose a surface or something, and they lose a little bit of control. So keep your eyes on the planes at all times. In other words, be ready to duck. Of course, you're safer this time. Jerry's not flying. So. To an, I'm sorry, uh, could, you, could you get to announce that someone with a white Equinox has got a flat tire? EDF taking off, he just made it. Somebody with a white Equinox in the parking lot has a flat tire. And the Zaggies are up. Go right after him, guys, because he doesn't have long on battery. Sounds like he's at LVC right now. On your mark, get set, go. There goes the jet. The P-47. Little ground loop on takeoff. There he goes. All right, the Texan going up, the AT-6. Good job, Gene. Barry with his T-28. Here goes the stop with Pups. Tim taxing out his gorgeous lightning. Madison drew the ticket. She's Madison here drew the ticket. Let's see what you got there, Madison. Thank you very much. Thank you so much. Okay, pilots, it's 007244. <laughs> Is that yours, Margaret? <laughs> I take it it's yours. <laughs> what was my first clue? Every year she wins at there least once. You should get one with everybody standing behind their plane, too. Yeah, get one with the planes first. Boy. <laughs> Steve, that's a beautiful aircraft. Yeah, he's got a great wow. You wouldn't believe the nose the time it's hitting us. The what? Get it watched really? Closely. Yeah. Wow. Okay, pilot's not going. Tim Brzezinski's still down there. This is his P-38 Lightning. Red Schultz standing behind his MiG, the EDF. Gene Thompson has his... TA-902 AT-6, Steve Zahn with the World War One plane, Mike Wentworth with the B-47, and Barry with his T-28. It's been a while ago. Heard that house has been for sale a couple of different times, too, since then. Gosh, this is that. Rob Pound flying his helicopter again, doing a nice demonstration. 